With all the water activities in Central Oregon comes a warning about something called swimmer's itch. Kelsey McGee talks with an expert about how you get it and what you can do. Friday at Wikiup Reservoir, boaters and swimmers were enjoying the water. But some visitors have reported to Deschutes County, pets appearing itchy after being in the lake. It has to do with the life cycle. It lives part of the time in a snail. The snail sheds it and then it's looking for a warm water host to transport it around. In the search for a host, the parasitic worm can attach to an animal, bird or human, causing what's referred to as swimmer's itch. The swimmer's itch rash can occur in lakes or ponds. It will burrow into your skin and that causes kind of an allergic reaction. So you can't get sick by it, but this is going to be annoying, kind of like a mosquito bite. The symptoms from swimmer's itch include a small red rash on the skin and itching. One of the ways that you can cut down um, is when you get out of the water, rinse off your legs, part that's maybe been in the, in the shallows with some clean water and towel off very vigorously with a towel and that friction will tend to break off those that haven't gotten all the way into your leg. Mason says you can treat swimmer's itch with calamine lotion or Benadryl. It tends to affect children more than adults because kids play in the shallow water where the organisms tend to live. It will most likely go away within a week and in most cases it won't require medical attention. Kelsey McGee, News Channel 21.